tether, it looks like. Uh, can this help, she says, stop autoimmune conditions? This is a great question. So when it comes to autoimmune conditions, I assume we're talking about things like potentially rheumatoid arthritis, Hashimoto's. These are conditions whereby the immune system has, in a sense, wrongfully started to target healthy tissue uh, to work against, to fight against. Now, the aim of brain retraining, uh, at least as we teach it in Reorigin, is really twofold. The primary aim is to achieve something called systematic desensitization. That is uh, a step-by-step -step approach whereby we start to uh, reduce our reactivity to certain triggers. Now, if we're being triggered by our body's own tissue or sensations or even symptoms, which we know can filter back around through interoception and create <laughs> a sort of vicious cycle. Um, this really gets into more of like the second aim of the program, which is also very important. And this second aim of our brain retraining program is to help with a global reduction of the so-called allostatic load. That's basically to say to reduce the total amount of stress load that can accumulate in the nervous system that keeps us in this vigilant, reactive, and yes, inflammatory state. There's actually been a lot of research done on this through the um, Ohio State University that shows that when we're in a state of vigilance, reacting to our own reactions, it actually leads to higher levels of C-reactive protein, which is an indication of um, inflammation in the body. So to this sense, whether or not brain retraining can be effective for autoimmune conditions I will say that there needs to be more research done here. I never want to just say, you know, yes, without uh, also saying that there hasn't been clinical data uh, substantiating the effectiveness of brain retraining for specific autoimmune types of conditions yet. My um, observation, however, and anecdotally, the stories that we get from our members is that by reducing that allostatic load, it does seem to put the body in a state that is far less reactive and better optimal or better suited for healing and recovery to naturally occur. 